Hello everybody, my name is Grief, and today we're playing Kingdom Come Deliverance. Where's the audio? That's the audio. Um, I'm gonna be real with you guys, I don't remember anything about what we're doing in this game. I don't remember a lot. Just got over being sick with COVID. Still, um... Recovering from the fatigue of being sick. Should be good by tomorrow. What did we do last time? Why are we here? I assume we need to go to that letter A. Oh. Oh, we're supposed to... No, I remember. We need to... We need to read a book. Oh, we need to read a book. Oh, no. We gotta read a book. Oh, no. Oh, there's three pages. Okay, um... Okay, so the idea is... Uh, we got we got to somehow sneak up to Capon during his date, and we got to uh, somehow show him uh, the words. We 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 got to lead him on to say the exact poem for the girl that he's with, because you know he can't be bothered to memorize it himself. And why not? We're available. We're always free to do something for Lord Hans Capon. Um. Okay. Uh. Gentle knight. Gentle knight, why linger on? I yearn thus for my love so long. Without her words to still my breast, who shall set my soul to rest? And now my heart in sorrow dwells, from melancholic pining swells, since I, alas, was forced to part from the mistress of my heart. Ah, Lord, let me not wait in vain. I yearn to see my love again. Oh, gentle sir, be of good cheer. I shall not cling to another, dear. Oh, that's that's pretty nice. Uh, to love and be forlorn. So they're go they're going on a good rhyme. So uh, we just need to we just need to remember like the rhymes. I think we just need to remember like the last words here. We should be good. Uh, to love and be forlorn. To love and be forlorn is like night without a dawn, to be close with naught to say, like winter frost in May. To have lips and yet kiss not is like leaving grain to rot. To love without consummating is like unsworn fields in the it's like unsown fields in the spring. I shall love you then, my dear, for as long as you lie with me here. If you'll not give your all to me, no longer shall I abide with thee. Uh, we can probably do without that one. Ode to women. Women is the root of sin. That's it, we're going with this one. We don't even need to know the words. Fair not, sir! I have memorized all the poems necessary. That's, that's all I'm actually going. We're gonna, we're gonna finish reading this one. Uh, okay, so it does seem like these are like three different degrees of poems. Woman is the root of sin, and yet of virtuous deeds again. In Eden, it was a woman's deed to pluck the apple from the tree. This rhyming scheme is starting to be a little bit more swayed. If you've no wealth to offer, you say, she will scorn you and turn away. But once you promise her treasure, she says she will love you forever. To murderous wrath she gives birth, leaving no peace on this earth. Wounds inflicted by swords, cut less deep than woman's barbed words. Okay, maybe we don't read the Ode to Women. Gentle Knight might be where we uh where we where we go with this poem. Uh hey Hans, I'm well, ready. You, yep, good to see you, father. Daddy, do we have another hood? My hood is tarnished. Hey, who's there? hey, what? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I thought I thought I lived here. Are you looking for someone? I thought I, th I thought this was my home. I apologize. This is a chest. Why can't I use it? Is someone there? Okay, so we got to do what? As soon as I'm ready, I must sell Hans Cape Hall. We can get going. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Hey, I'm ready. Greetings. 
about that affair of yours. Henry, you don't pay attention to a word I say. Uh, <laughs> you don't pay attention to a word I say to come in the evening. My bad, the journal just said to talk to you. Maybe you should speak to my future self. This is three days earlier's fault. When is this the evening? When is evening technically? We're, we're just gonna. Uh, I believe 21 is evening. But I say good evening like around here. This is when I start telling people good evening. Where is he? There he is. I assume the option's still grayed out. Okay, yep. So, oh yeah, we're hungry. Um, deal. You know, mother of God. Can people stop talking about how I look? You've been you've been selling the stuff. For a while now, I'm finally here to buy from you. Just buy a bunch of milk. Henry's favorite. He loves... Loves milk. We saw bacon too. He didn't actually need to buy any of that. Well, let's just start eating all this milk we got. Oh wow, milk fills you up! Um... Okay, uh... So we're going to wait till... 21. What? <clears throat> does does that? We're <coughs> out a dry spot. Oh, uh, wait until Sir Hans ready. Oh, okay. So yeah, no, this is around the time that I would suspect that that would be. So where is he? Okay, he's currently in the tower. Oh, uh, we're getting tired too. Uh, do I have any potions? Uh, this is wild, I don't have any cockerel potions. Okay. That's fine. That's fine, I don't- I don't need any cockerel potions. We can do this while a little bit drowsy. Stay awake for your boy. We could probably visit the potion maker and see if he has any to sell. He probably does. Atta sir! Ready, Sir Hans. Henry, something, something's gone wrong. Open up. I'm not going to talk to the door. God. Is he eating cold feet? That potion tasted rather odd, and now I have a feeling my face is broken out. How do I look? <laughs> like a monster. <laughs> oh wow! Look at that. The zero. We could tell him anything. You're imagining it, sir. You look as irresistible as ever, if not more. But I feel as if I just fell face first into a nettle patch. Yeah, yeah you you're look just it. a little flush from the excitement. It'll pass. If you're sure. So, what do you think? Can we go to the rendezvous? Why wait? Carolina won't be able to resist you. All right, then. Lead on, heart. And you, Henry, follow me. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't remember uh, the poems. That's okay, we have the book, so we can just read it. Oh no, is he gonna walk at a slow pace the entire time? It's nighttime, no one should be able no, no one should be able to even see your face. You'll be fine. Yeah, you're worried about nothing, sir. It hurts my throat. That was sore throat from the COVID. Oh man, I feel so fatigued. I do feel much better though. I'm not like dying. Uh, I can actually wear clothes without them hurting. Tell that me, was Henry, the thing. Oh. How many girls have you had in your life? 
If you've had any at all, that is. Well, there's been a few. Very respectful. I'm sure I can't compare with you. Ha! <laughs> Very true. One day, plays will be written about my amorous adventures. Oh, no, These that. These are tragedies. That might depend on how things go tonight. What's the dialogue? For the audio. It'll go well, sir. Trust me. I got you covered. Mutt. I'm gonna need you to be really quiet during this. I know you like to bark. Please don't. Oh, we're gonna walk the entire way. I do not like this. What, what, what are these quests called? These escort quests. Normally escort quests I'm fine with, but when they're walking at snail's pace, that's when I have a problem. Because now I have to sit here and talk. My throat hurts. I was coughing There's for like two days. There's another girl living in this house here. But she's already got a suitor. Not for long, oh, sir. Bothered you. Since the time her fellow threw me headfirst into a dung heap and kicked my ass for good measure. It seems your future subjects don't hesitate to take a stick to you when it comes to minding the women folk. I thought I was I special for beating them up. You recognize me. I was, um, incognito. <laughs> I thought I was special. I thought I was the only one who beat him up. Turns out everyone in this town has beat up Cape on at some point. I'm escorting Sir Haunt. <sighs> there. You happy? Oh. That was nice. We gave him a groschen. We're almost there. You'll hide behind a gravestone or in the bushes and don't budge from there. Otherwise, you might scare her off. Okay, so now I need to put the torch away. Where am I hiding exactly? Hide, Henry. Time to get started. How do you know it's her who will come out and not someone else? She got the letter and necklace, didn't she? I she knows that I'm... That is, her secret admirer is coming. And what am I supposed to do? What do you think, Dalt? Prompt me from that book of poetry. Where am I supposed to hide? There's nowhere to hide! Do I just- do I just crouch here or something? Better move on. I don't want to turn up late to see the love of my life. I don't- I don't know where to hide! Oh, hold on. There's a bush right here. Have you lost something? Get a move on. I don't want to turn up late to see the love of my life. Is he okay? Get a move on. I don't want to turn up late to see the love of my life. Is, is... What's that? Shh. Get a move on. I think he's broke. Turn up late to see the love of my life. Are you okay? Get a move on. I don't want to turn up late to see the love of my life. Can I like click on this bush or something? Oh. Oh no, there's a button I can click there. <coughs> oh. Oh right, yeah, her house is right there. See you. Your most ardent admirer, fair maid. Aha! Uh -huh. And do you have a name? What's in a name? That which we call a rose by any other name would... would still be a... flower, wouldn't it? That was good, that was good. Nailed it. Start. How? Oh god. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, wait, I didn't, I didn't. I forgot to read the book. I forgot to read the book! What are you saying? I can't hear you. Oh god, that was so well done. Uh Woman is the root of sin. Uh it's gentle night. Why do I linger on? I yearn thus for my love so long. Without her words to still my breast, who shall set my soul to rest? You gave him a gentle long night. word. Why linger oh? on? 
I earned this from my love so long. Whip out your worthy silky breasts. Who shall suck my salty bits? Yeah, 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 got it. Good job. Uh, okay, uh, now my heart. And now my heart in sorrow dwells. Yep, see, oh, we remember this. Pining swells, since I, alas, was forced to part from the mistress of my heart. I know my horses sort of well. Some alcohol from nine to twelve. Seems I always have whores apart from the mistress of my heart. You know, I'm impressed that he's rhyming this. What are you saying? What's that hissing? It's, uh, a feral goose here in the bushes. <laughs> uh... I shall love you then, my dear. I think this one. I shall love you then, my dear. As long as you lie with me here. If you'll not give your Oh, that was the wrong me, one. No longer shall I bide with thee. I shall let you drink my beer. As long as you, uh, buy one for me. If you'll not give your ale to me, no longer shall I buy for thee. Yep, Jesus nailed it. What kind of yokel nonsense are you babbling? Me? You're the one who's babbling. <laughs> You're an odd one. I've never heard such peculiar poetry in my life. Where on earth did you come up with it? From the heart. Blame the French. Say nothing. Uh. Coward. Say something. How did you like it, dearest? Ah, speak from your heart. How tender you are. You all know what happened. Got this. Father is coming. Hide. Why does he have to hide? That's terrible hiding. He just crouched. Did you hear what he said? No, I have a bad feeling about this, Hans. I think we should. Are you still there? Still here, my love. How could I have apart from you? Father's coming. He'll kill you. He will not. Because it'll never cross his mind where I'll be. Henry, it's time for me to claim my prize. Whatever happens. Cover my back. You want me to what? There you are. You said you, sir. Now you'll see how a butcher protects his daughter's honor. Buy me time. Fuck you. you. Explaining to do, you bastard. Okay, okay. We can talk our way out of this. We can talk our way out of this. What are you after? <sighs> you bastard sneaking around <laughs> in all this <laughs> citizen's house in the dark. Um. I went to mourn over the grave of my great grandmother. It was so sad. Oh, yeah. So sad. Then what are you doing right beneath my window, eh? It's not your the window. The question is, why are you trampling on Great Granny's grave, eh? <laughs> Enough of your horseshit. One more word, and I'll have you. Dad, what are you doing here? Oh, my darling. Get out! Get out, or I'll call Papa. My sweet, how can you be so cruel? Hey, what was that? Uh, okay, okay, uh, nothing. It was the wind. That noise? I'm sure I heard a strange noise. We're here in the cemetery. Maybe restless spirits, what do you reckon? <laughs> I'd yep, ghosts. I'd from the window of my own house. Well, what's that got to do with me? Someone's <laughs> been creeping around after my daughter. For gaslighting, this guy's so hard. I find you here. Quite a coincidence, eh? So, out with the truth. You're quite mistaken. I've never laid eyes on your daughter. And if she looks anything like you, I'd rather keep it that way. Damn! Why you you... fucking... Yeah, we fucking killed this man. What you're doing? Climbing in here, uninvited? Ma chérie, I came to court you. Then go and court me from the courtyard. Don't try to make a fool of me. <laughs> I heard it clearly. What was that? Uh... Uh... Are you alright? It seems to me you're hearing things <laughs> other folk can't hear. That's not good. Uh oh, we're really making this guy crazy. In my head. Well, that's not necessarily a bad thing. <laughs> Sent you for a scene of Pilot's heard voices too, and she found it a monastery and churches and things. I heard voices too. Uh, well, could have been voices. I wouldn't swear to it though. We should Look, build a church. I was standing right here, and I didn't hear a thing. Do you take me for a madman? Whatever you are, I want to know what you're doing under my daughter's window, and who was talking to her. I heard it clear as day. 
Uh, you missed her. I was praying. The neighbor, it can't be denied that old age dulls a man's ears. I'm here alone, praying for the souls of the good people resting in the cemetery. I've nothing to do with your daughter. Hmm. That voice sounded different to yours, though. The but ghost. Where did he get to? You must have seen him. Unless, unless you're covering for him. What? You don't love me? No. And I told you, get out. Well, how about a kiss at least? Out, out, out. Distract his attention. What the fuck are you playing at? My oh. patience is wearing thin. Uh, continue singing. Henry, you're killing it. Your damn screeching. Continue singing, don't stop. Yesu, Yesu, Maria, Volala, 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 Jesu, Yesu, Maria, Yesu, Yemene, Buddha, little rapets, Nebone, Buddha, little rapets, Nebone, fucking drum bars. Christ Almighty. Let's go, fellas. This one ain't right in the head. The guards will have him for screeching after curfew. Let's not get mixed up in it. But if I ever see you here again, I'll beat some sense into your idiot skull. What, you have the gall to show your face here again? <laughs> I wonder if we failed it uh, because of the poem or if just Capon was that terrible. I'm... <laughs> I'm so curious because we got the last we got the last verse wrong. What if we got all three verses right? What if? Where is my bed located in this place? I don't even know. Am I the second floor? Third floor? I know I can sleep here, right? Yeah, here we go. Oh, that was... Wait, sleeping for one hour. Why am I sleeping for one hour? Uh... Okay. That was weird. So, do you think he got a second date? Or a first date? How does this work when you, I went through all that trouble? Is that considered a date? Like, he got her to look out the window. <coughs> oh, man. Blah, 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 blah. Hello, Daddy. Where uh, is Capon? You in here, bud? How you feeling? Greetings. How did it go with Carolina Sands? It was a disaster, Henry. A disaster. How come? Didn't your recitation do the trick? What kind of nonsense were you feeding me? Carolina thought I was a thief breaking in to rob the place. I tried to explain, but she wouldn't listen. She told me to get out or she'd call her father. Oh, you're lucky I managed to keep him busy. Only now he thinks I'm the village idiot. Well, thanks for that at least. Anyway, Carolina slammed the door in my face, so I suppose I'll have to look elsewhere for the love of my life. Mm. Well, back to writing love letters. To hell with love letters. Imagine. That silly goose couldn't even read. True. Oh, she, she missed out on something very rare. Indeed. <laughs> Here's the letter, Henry. Read it. At least you're capable of appreciating my literary talent. Read and learn from a poet. 
Goodbye. So I wonder if I go back and if I give him the correct words, will he uh will he woo her? We got here. My sweetest, I am your most devoted secret admirer, secret for until I know you long for me as I do for you. I shall not make myself known to you. But once we know each other, then my beloved poppet, I shall caress your tits. Then I shall seek out the treasure you have carried with you since birth. For there is no lovelier creature than you. I only have to think of you and I raise a battle tent. <sighs> the likes of which even Sigismund would envy. You must be mine and none others. I shall take you to paradise and back. Shall meet all the angels in heaven and call out to God more loudly than ever before. If you want to feel like no woman has ever felt before, Put on this necklace tomorrow, and I shall know that I should come to you in the night and slip inside your secret garden. Your most secret ardent- your, your most secret admirer. You know what? I'm starting to wonder if it actually wasn't my fault. So you're all dressed up and ready to go. Got over that pretty fast. There. Are you going to talk to me or are you going to ignore me? Are you going to pretend that uh, you didn't just hand me that uh, that smut you called a love letter? Hey, Henry's come to see us. Oh, Henry's here. You can at least act like my father. I don't think Hans is going to talk to us until we get to the camp. Do you think he's just going to walk there? Why doesn't he park his horse here? Okay, well, um, what do I do? I guess... I guess I just go on ahead? Talk to Capon. Oh, camp. I guess I just go on ahead to the camp. He's wearing the armor that, like, he should be wearing at the camp. I guess before we go, we say goodbye to Teresa. We won't be seeing her for a while. This is it, everybody. The finale. I remember fighting the people there. Getting my early money, getting my unarmed skills increased. I remember killing a horrid amount of sheep over there. Like a crazed serial killer. Get my bow skills up. I remember stabbing the family in that house multiple times to increase my sword skills. I remember getting my hair cut here. That's Hans' horse. Uh, it was here where I got my pickpocketing skills up. I knocked out that tradesman right there. Filled her pockets full of loot and repeatedly pickpocketed her. She eventually died because it turns out you can only knock out someone so many times. Who knew? This is where I started off my skullduggery ways. Let me pickpocket, lock picking, grave digging. Don't pee on the bench. How rude. I've got something for. I hope you won't need them. Thank you. Are they bandages? Thank you. Can you repair my clothes? I've got something that needs. <laughs> All right. I can't have you walking around. It. Thank you, Teresa. You have been a good woman to me. I have been a lesser man, but better for it. I am off now. As a noble lord takes on his first quest outside of the lands, outside of his home. Wish me luck. Uh, hold on. Uh, how do I get off the horse? I need to give her something to remember me by. 
can't drop any of these. Here, my favorite hat. Keep it. Remember me. I trust you do well. I remember this town. This is the town where I also started killing people so I can increase my sword skills. <coughs> God, my throat is so dry. Dying! I need a cough drop. But I can't do a cough drop and have a play a video at the same time. Ah, uh, yes. I killed the people who lived here as well. To increase my sword skills. Oh yes, the miller's house over there. I remember killing everyone there before realizing that was a miller that lived there. I never got caught for that. Also to raise my sword skills. Yeah. Odechko. I remember there were woodcutters up there who ran away from me because I was killing them. But I ended up getting the last, last laugh as I killed them for my sword skills. The archery competition, which I have never won before until I started doing these recordings and then I started winning. I earned a little bit of money from that, not too much. The town where I did all the stuff for the charlatan. There were no sword skills raised that day. But it was still a funny quest line. This quest was really funny. The amorous adventures of Lord Capon. It was it was really good. Um, I'm taking like a weird route to get to where I need to be. <coughs> <coughs> Coughing ASMR. You're welcome. Ah, a wayfarer. <laughs> For old time's sake. In order to increase my stealth skills. That sound. The hell? Why is there a dead animal here? Oh my gosh! What in the name of God are you doing, Poacher? What the fuck? Holy sh- <sighs> What the hell are you talking <sighs> about? What are you doing here? Looking for your that kill, was scary. Are you, you poacher? That dead deer? Uh... I'm traveling the province in the service of Sarata Kabila. Did she kill this deer and she trying to blame me? Heavens! Begging you pardon. I didn't mean anything. Alright. I suppose you're innocent after all. I'm also the... Sense. Game Master here. We'll just have to report it to someone. Unfortunately, there's not much we can do about it. Why does she have a bow on her? 
that was terrifying. What kind of jump scare was that? Oh my gosh. I can't really say much about what happened over here. I know there's some bandits that live around here and we've probably killed them for sword experience. Um, now oh, there it is. Ah yes. This hut. No one lives here. That windmill, the first time we got into a uh, group fight, or it was us versus three. We had no hope of winning that fight, but we used our wits to win. Oh, I need to eat. It's a good thing we picked up some food on the way over. I just eat an egg? No. No, we still have milk. I'll just keep eating milk. There we go. Just drink three gallons of spoiled milk. We also killed a bunch of people that lived over there. Here's where we did the Band of Bastards DLC. Um, turned out we were supposed to uh, get our Band of Bastards to help us out with the bandits in the woods over there. I didn't realize that. I just killed the bandits by myself. But that was probably one of our biggest group fights we've done. Uh, that ended fairly successfully with a uh, low uh, low negatives I see for all time's sake ow ow Oh, that's good. You all want to fight me? Come here. Oh, bitch, I'm a hot man. Ellie, for you, Spear. Enjoy this. Ow. Christ. You can go. Understand me? Clear off and never come back. I assume that means thank you. He has had long enough. Let the hunt begin! Oh no, I got him. Ah, we used to struggle with the cumins and the bandits. But thanks to our endless, uh... Education or endless studying of the blade. We're not able to face them with ease. And because we're also wearing some really strong armor, but that definitely helps. This is where I helped a whore uh, rob a whole bunch of people. I don't know if they're bad people. But they definitely weren't good people. I didn't really get any skills out of that. That was that was just a weird side quest I went on in my free time. That forest right there, I went up and down it so many times. It, uh, There's no way I can get lost in that forest now. I know every bit of that forest, like the back of my hand, because of how long we got stuck in there. Yeah. Having to look for Ginger and like the bandits. Having to find all the different uh, coal makers, whatever they're called. What are they called? Wood burners? I don't, I don't know.
Now we're coming up on... What is this one called? I, f I forget the name of this town. Neuhof, that's what it is. I was gonna say Merhoyed, but it's not. Neuhof. One of our first big missions. This really led us to where we needed to go. That, uh... Whole place was, uh, sort of like burned and attacked. The owner of the horses was killed. Uh, the stable master. Someone else had to take over for him. Shh, it's okay, bud. Go to sleep. We returned Ginger there and he gave us some free riding lessons. Everything is back to normal. The dead shall not be rising. Um, I think that's about it. We're back. We're here. Where's Cape on? He's not here yet. Oh, uh, we gotta wait for him. Hello, men. Mind if I partake in some of your stew? Where is he right now? Check out the map. Uh, oh, he's almost here. Just need to wait like three hours. Ouch. Oh man, my spine. I need to do some exercises tonight. Work out, do some sit-ups. I'll do some jumping jacks, but one of my roommates is sleeping downstairs and I think they would be able to hear that. Ah, there he is. Can we go? Are you ready for this? I want to ask you a few more things. What? I wanted to ask you a few things. Yeah, speech. For all time's sake. Ah, oh, that's a lot of stuff I don't care to know about. Of course. At last I'll get to see more of the country and have a bit of an outing. Quite. Oh, look at all those achievements. Hardcore Henry, tis but a scratch. Let's get to it then. And the end. I finally have the feeling we're doing something worthwhile. We're helping to save the king. Instead of saving his drunken majesty, I'd rather find that horseman who murdered my parents, get the sword back from him, and skewer him with it. Cheer up, Henry. I have a feeling you'll get your chance one day, and it won't be long in coming. Forward, men! Authentis Fortuna Yuvat! Absolutely beautiful game. So good. And that music. Listen to that orchestra go. Thank you so much for everybody who has been watching these from the beginning to the end. Even just like watching parts of it, just coming in at the end. Just anyone who has participated at all. Yeah, you, you have all been absolutely wonderful. Reading all the comments uh, that you guys have posted uh, for for this, uh, this this series, it has been phenomenal. Like absolutely changing my view. This uh, the the first episode itself. Uh, what what did I call it? Uh, my new obsession. Uh, episode one. That has not the most views, but. I think the most viewed time out of all my uh, videos, there is my Garden of Band Band video, but I think that's just people like hovering over it and it just gets like strange amounts of likes for no reason. This one definitely has the most comments and it has like the most likes. And it's, it's astounding to see the fan base that this game has and that the second game has not come out yet. Though I do hear another game is coming out, and it's uh, supposed to be either announced or released in the, what is it, the 
final quarter of this year. So here's to hoping we get a uh, a new Kingdom Come game. I'm excited to see uh, what the future holds for this. Uh, I recommend anyone who hasn't played this game to play it. It's not a game for ev everyone. Uh, know that I'm playing on hardcore mode. You can make this a lot easier on yourself by playing normal mode. You don't have to have every debilitating illness in the world. And getting experience is a lot easier if you're not playing on hard mode. You can easily uh, kind of plow through the game on the lower diff on the normal difficulty setting. But um, let me know what everyone thought. Thank you so much. I don't know where we're going from here. Let me know if there's any game recommendations you want me to play. Uh, I'm probably just going to start playing random games uh, for now. Just see what uh, sort of catches on. And I want to uh, essentially... My, my goal is to, when the new Cyberpunk DLC comes out, I want to play Cyberpunk then. So preferably if we can find a game that's a little bit on the shorter spectrum. <laughs> like maybe like a month or two worth of content then the, the, that would be like an ideal length of game to play uh, if not that's fine I'll probably just be making two videos a day and that'll just be a little bit more work on my part but hey I do enjoy doing this you guys are wonderful thank you so much for watching have a good night or day whatever time you're watching this I'll see you guys in the next video goodbye